Illegal logging has always been a subject of serious concern in Papua New Guinea, and a development partner that's willing to assist it to deal with the issue is the European Union, which is one of the largest consumers of timber products in the world. The EU has regulations in place to promote good governance of the forestry sector in timber exporting countries like PNG. And yesterday, the PNG National Forest Authority held a workshop to enlighten relevant stakeholders on the European Union Forest Law Enforcement Governance and Trade Initiative. Esther Bralinwani has more. The Department of Forest, the European Union and other stakeholders held a workshop on European Union forest law enforcement, governance and trade. This workshop was aimed at looking at the possible ways to implement the European Union forest law through informing PNG stakeholders on the action plan, discussing initiatives undertaken in the area of timber certification and discuss the way forward to reinforce sustainable and legal logging. Officiating at the workshop, Forest Minister Douglas Tomoresa said the forest law is now a priority policy issue for both timber producing and consuming countries. Forest uh, law enforcement and governance and trade is now a priority uh, policy issue that both timber pro uh, producing and uh, consuming countries because of the market concerns of the impact of the timber trade uh, of the global environment. Minister Tomoresa further stated that PNG has limited markets with the European Union in terms of forest products. Meanwhile, National Forest Service Acting Managing Director Goodwill Amos said there are some forest companies who have acquired international certificates to enable them to undertake trainings. Noting that some of PNG's major industry operators, and some of them are here, they've been invited, have already obtained international certifications such as Forest Stewardship Council Control Wood, Forest Stewardship Control Forest Management, and the TLTV uh, systems, it's the TBA, TBA legality and tracer verification systems. These certification systems will enable them to continue tra trading if they exist in any markets. The person for certification is voluntary in the engine. Esther Berlin Wani, NBC National News, Port Mosby.